This is no ordinary bus. It houses activities such as coding a game in one hour, programming a robot, tinkering with a gadget and learning how electronic works. This mobile tech platform, a collaboration between the Infocom Development Authority and industry partners, was launched by Minister for Communications and Information, Dr. Jacob Ibrahim, on the 8th of November at Vivo City. It is our hope that the programs on board will spark our students' interest and spur them to explore their interest in technology further, but as a minimum, to make them comfortable with technology. The students will be encouraged to pursue technology as part of their curriculum or career. This, in turn, will build the local tech talent for Singapore. We hope that this will give our young, budding technopreneurs a head start in creating cool, fun and useful gadgets. And in the long run, we hope this will inspire them to even consider the various career opportunities which are available in the sector. The 40-seater bus, retrofitted with engaging and innovative technology, will be travelling to primary schools and public places to conduct workshops and fun activities. Learning in a bus, there's actually aircon and it's actually very fun. The mentors will come personally to teach you how to do some of the programming. All the things that we learn in the bus is all about games. While in the classroom, we learn about science and sometimes the Sometimes the teacher might not make the lessons as interesting. Mr. Steve Leonard, Executive Deputy Chairman of IDA, adds that the larger goal is to contribute to the collective effort in building a smart nation. Well, first, to be a smart nation, we have to have a lot of people be both interested in and curious about technology. Not everybody has to be an engineer, but we have to have people say, how does this work? Why does it go like this? So sometimes just creating some curiosity among young kids that might want to go on and learn more is part of our goal. And the idea is some may actually want to be engineers and we'd love to help start them on that journey. I'm more interested in IT after today because last time I don't even know what is IT. And after today I, I learned how to program robots and I also learned how to use battery to program anything. It was a fun experience for me as I have learned very interesting things and I'm quite interested in some of the program inside. It is hoped that this mobile learning platform will get students engaged and excited about technology. IDA is targeting to reach out to 80 primary schools and 16,000 students over the next two years.